people do not turn towards religion because of their love for Jesus or their love for God. It is because of the fear that they have, the fear of the unknown of when they do transition from this realm. It is the fear of going to a such place called hell, which is only a state of consciousness. It's two different states of consciousness. Hell is the lower state. Higher state is heaven. The, the heaven that we ascend to. We ascend when we transition. So if heaven is a higher state of mind and its representation is ascension, what do you think hell is? That kingdom come, that will be done on earth as it is in heaven. So if heaven is up there, I digress. People only turn towards religion because of the fear of the unknown. They do not want to go to hell or they feel like they're going to go to hell. That's what we're all told. All of us have been taught, majority of us, I'm not going to say all of us, a majority of us who have come from religious backgrounds full of religious uh, beliefs, we are taught that if we commit sin, if we are sinful, and if we do not follow the instructions given in the Bible, we are going to go to hell. And we're going to burn for eternity. It's not like, no. We can't die. When we go in ascension, and when we transition, we ascend. We have two selves. We have a higher self and we have a lower self. Our higher self represents heaven, ascension, eternity. That's where we go. We, we, we advance, we ascend into a higher version of our soul. That's all there is to it. There is no such thing as heaven or hell. There's just two states of consciousness. But people turn towards religion because of their fear. And we are only the judge of ourselves. We are the judges. We are everything. We judge ourselves. Judging other people is like judging ourselves. We are the judges. We are gods. We are everything. Everything is us. So when people turn towards religion, it is not because of the love for God or the love that people have for God. It is because they don't want to go to such a place called hell. When you think about it, isn't that kind of selfish? Isn't that, isn't that selfish? People call things selfish, but really don't even know the definition of what selfish is. So you're only going towards religion because it's what you were taught, it's what a lot of us was taught to believe is true, and what is taught to us about heaven, going to heaven, and ascending, living for eternity. Religion was to control and destroy. Now I'm going to speak for Christianity. Now, it's different parts of Christianity, but I can talk about that in another video. It's a lot of things that people don't know about Christianity that will really shake up a lot of things. Religion has caused a world of confusion. People have created this religion to control people. When you tell a person something, when you tell them that they are less than, and if you tell them that you, they have to follow a book of laws, a set of laws, a system, and they believe it, you control their mind. If you can control their mind, you can control a person's actions. Think about it. People do a lot of things in the name of Jesus. People do and commit. They commit mur uh, murder. They commit all these things, all these different things, and then use scriptures to beat other people up with. We determine our reality. We determine things. We determine th how things are gonna go. Now, there are some things that are out of our control, but we can still make do with it. A lot of people that are pastors, your, your world leaders, all these people, right? Create a lot of destruction. Every time pastor did this, this world leader did this, they caused destruction, chaos, all this, all these things. But they're still prosperous. They know that they have power over their life. 
they know that they're the generator operator and the destroyer they don't believe that they are less than deserving we shape our reality we cause our expansion in different aspects of our life we cause those things like i said there are some things that may be out of our control but we can always change things into our favor just by tapping in in tune with our energy we're all energetic beings we all have a soul we all have a vessel we all have spirit we all have energy but yeah it is all about world domination taking control over the masses controlling what goes on in people's lives controlling a person's mind mind control religion is mind control it's a bunch of manipulation manipulating people's energy to cause a world that is more beneficial to the people that created the religion world domination world dominance that is what it's all about but the masses they we only turn towards we turn towards something that soothes our ego that's why a lot of people become righteous holy and i think i it's about balance i think none of us are holy or like really be real with ourselves we all have thought of things that are evil a little white lie we've all told little white lies none of us are perfect none of us are none of us are saints we are saints in our own given nature yeah we are everything we it's a balance it is life none of us are perfect none of us are not perfect it's just like i said it's about balance peace and chaos when you read a book you have two people you have the people you have one person who reads and they follow the instructions then you have the other person that dives deeper and yeah they read but they also ask questions about what they're reading they're also trying to interpret what they read is it just a story or is it a story about myself those are two different types of people the one that's reading the story but they not following along they're, they're there but they not there and the second person they read the story but then they come to terms and grasp that that story is about them leave a comment in the comment section down below and tell me what y'all think why do you think people turn towards religion why do people turn towards religion? Like I said, people turn towards religion because of a fear-based tactic that they have that was instilled in them since they came into this physical realm. Let me know what y'all think. And if you want to see more conscious content, make sure to subscribe and click the notification bell so you won't miss out. And like always, this channel is all about raising our level of consciousness and our vibration so that we can help manipulate our own realities the way that we want them to be and not nobody else and i'm also on instagram and tiktok true ascension and you can go follow me on there as well and i'll see y'all next time peace and abundance peace and chaos